everyone, I'm Captain Smith, the Director of Safety and Security. And I'm Chastity Burke, the Security Operations Coordinator. This month's Schools of Character topic is honesty. It's a simple word, but it holds immense power. Honesty is the foundation of trust, integrity, and genuine human connections. When we are honest, we create a ripple effect that spreads far and wide. We build relationships based on trust where open communication flourishes. Honesty allows us to connect with others on a deep, authentic level, fostering understanding and empathy. Honesty isn't always easy. It requires courage. The courage to speak the truth, even when it's difficult or unpopular. It means taking responsibility for our actions and acknowledging our mistakes. Honesty demands self-reflection and a commitment to personal growth. In our personal lives, honesty is the compass that guides our interactions with loved ones. It ensures that our relationships are built on a solid foundation of trust and respect. When we are honest with ourselves, we gain a deeper understanding of who we are and what truly matters to us. Honesty also extends beyond ourselves and our immediate circles. It shapes the society we live in. When we demand honesty from our leaders, institutions, and media, we foster a culture of accountability and integrity. Honesty empowers us to challenge falsehoods and seek the truth. Let us strive to be beacons of honesty. Let us choose truth over convenience, integrity over shortcuts. By embodying honesty in our words and actions, we inspire others to do the same. Together, let us create a society that values and celebrates honesty, where trust and authenticity prevail. Good morning, Beachside students. Today is Monday, January 8th. I'm going to read your daily breach by news. Please don't put the <laughs> The so choices for today will be boneless wings or PB and J bundle. Tomorrow we'll be having meat and queso nachos. Please remember to follow B-Side C Turtles expectations in the cafeteria. This means a voice on one or two. Stay seated facing forward, raise your hand if you need anything. Now to Amanda with the budget. I'm in the daily report. Today will be a chance of rain, temperatures will be a high of 68 degrees and a low of 64 degrees. Now to Dana and Lillian with this announcements. Good morning, Beachside Sea Turtles. I'm with Dana with the special announcements. Hey, good morning, Beachside Elementary. Mr. Harris here, coming from your school. I came in this morning from Seabreeze High School, home of the Sand Crabs, and many of you know where that's at. It's right down the road from you, and I wanted to come down and just show our support to you and your principal and all the great things you have going on here. But most importantly, I wanted to come and talk to you a little bit about SWIM, about showing respect to all, working cooperatively, implementing safe choices. That's a huge one. We all got to be safe and modeling responsibility daily. So 
Showing respect is big. I tell my kids, even at the high school level, when you're talking, you're going to respect your teachers. You're going to respect your, the people of authority. You're going to obey right away. All right? And that's how we show respect to all, especially those teachers in the classroom who are coming every single day to help you. That is a big deal to Mr. Harris. That's a huge deal to the Sand Crab Nation. Work cooperatively. Be nice to each other. Work together. You're not always going to get along, and that's okay, but we need to be kind to everybody, right? Not everybody's going to be your friend, but we need to be friendly to everyone. That's how we do it at Seabreeze, and that's how the Sand Crab Nation works. Implement safe choices. That's probably the biggest one. We need to be safe. We need to make safe choices, and we need to do all those great things to keep us all safe here at school. So that's a big one. That's usually the one when I think about getting in trouble, you know, and things of that nature. It's usually because of safe choices. Maybe you're leaving the room without permission, which is totally unsafe. Nobody knows where you're at. We got to know where you're at. So that's an unsafe choice. Putting your hands on another student because you're at upset. That can hurt somebody. That's unsafe. We don't do that. We don't do that here. We don't do that at Seabreeze. All right, so that's a swim expectation. And modeling responsibility. Be responsible. That's a tough one. That takes time, right? And that's why you have great teachers and a great principal and all those great things is because we all need help learning to be responsible, right? And that's when we admit our mistakes and own our mistakes. We don't blame other people, right? I'm sure you got people going, but he did it, but she did it. No, it doesn't matter. You own it and you be responsible for those actions. But I wanted to go over that real quick. That's an awesome thing you all got going here. Swim with the turtles and all that stuff. I think that's super cool. But I wanted to talk about this, right? Mr. Harris and the Seabreeze Sand Crabs wanted to present this to you. And this is going to be given to a student who, at the end of the third quarter, is showing the most improvement with swim expectations. So we wanted to bring you a bicycle. I wanted to present it to your principal. Did you want to come up to hop yeah, over here? Hop absolutely, over. Absolutely. And I wanted to pass this over to you. And, Appreciate uh, that, inside, Mr. Harris. Inside, Thank you so much. Thank just, you so much. And just show our support to you as Thank a high you. school and your elementary school. Thank I, you. I'm sure I'll get a lot of your kids one day. You are. They're all going to be headed your way. And I know you have the same expectations <laughs> that we here have at Beachside. And so we're working really hard every single day, guys. And as Mr. Harris explained, we've got to make sure we're meeting those swim expectations. So we're working hard every single day. Every minute counts. And we're making sure that we're doing it the turtle way. And guess what? We're all swimming together. Yes. Here. Over here on the beach side with Seabreeze High School, we are all swimming together to make these schools the best they can be and make you the best you can be. So let's be working hard for this bike. I can't wait. Will you come back and help us present it Absolutely. to the winning student? I would love to. All right, Definitely. that would be fantastic. Maybe I'll bring some students with me oh, too. Oh, that would and be we amazing. Can make, make a big deal out of it. Absolutely. Because to make improvements, it's a big deal. It's yep. a big deal. We yep. all we all work to do that. Yes, we do. Working right. together, swimming together. All right, beach side turtles. Thank you guys so much for your time. Today we're going to be focusing on the eye and swim. Implement safe choices. Lillian, do you have an example of that? When you arrive, when you arrive to school, like walk to your assigned area. Don't like go to a different place and see goof off. I agree. Hey turtles, this year we will be having an attendance challenge. The class that has the best attendance each month will receive the attendance trophy as well as a special treat at the end of the month. At the end of the year, the class that keeps the trophy the longest will receive a special surprise. Individual students with no unexcused absences will receive brag tags and bracelets. Remember, if you are sick, we do not want you to come to school until you are feeling better. But you can remind your parent to call the front office to let us know that you are sick. If you are to the doctor, you can bring a doctor's note into the front office as well. Remember when we all practice honesty, we all, at school and in our community, we all make Beachside Elementary a school of character. Today only happens once. Make it count, make it amazing. Everyone have a great, turtle fantastic day at school. Bye. From all of us at Beach Break News, happy